Cars inside a Birmingham parking garage were targeted by vandals over the weekend in a very unusual way. Several vehicles had their tires deflated. Our Gino Vici joins us from Peabody and Brown Street in downtown Birmingham with more on why those vehicles were targeted. Yes, several vehicles were targeted here in downtown Birmingham over the weekend. In all of those instances, their tires were deflated. And in all of those instances, a very bizarre note was left behind explaining why it had to be done. I was obviously upset. I uh, wasn't very happy. Brian Borich has plenty to be upset about. He was in downtown Birmingham over the weekend getting a haircut. When he got done, he got back inside his SUV and noticed something unusual, a pamphlet on his window. I thought maybe I had a gotten a ticket from the police, but I was like, well, I, I'm not parked illegally. But it was no ticket. I got out of the vehicle, grabbed the pamphlet, and I read it, and it said that, you know, it was just in this group that they're uh, going, my that they flattened my tires because of the type of vehicle I drive. That's right. A group known as the Tire Extinguishers claimed to have deflated Brian's tires, all because he drives an SUV. The letter goes on to say, your gas guzzler kills. You'll be angry, but don't take it personally. It's not you. It's your car. And it says they've deflated one or more of his tires. On that letter, a name the tire extinguishers. Their goal is to reduce carbon emissions and bring attention to climate change. Brian says whatever caused their fighting, doing stuff like this certainly isn't helping. I think they're doing the wrong thing by the way they're approaching it. To damage people's vehicles, that's not the right way to do it. In Birmingham, Gino Vici, CBS News, Detroit. Gino, thank you. According to police, if someone is caught deflating tires, they could be charged with disorderly conduct. And if any damage occurs as a result of it, more serious charges are possible.